Tomorrow night at 10.45, Owain Arwell Hughes looks at the Sanctus, one of the moments where the Requiem is at one with the ordinary Mass in joyous praise of God. And now, the Gospel according to St. Luke, Programme 2, in which Jesus calls the disciples together and tells them that they should journey to Jerusalem, where he shall... That specially composed theme music for this series, performed by the London Chamber Orchestra, is available on a BBC single. The third of these films can be seen tomorrow morning on BBC One at 10.30, and again at 11.20 tomorrow night. Well, the evening begins with Wogan in Wellies, crossing spades with Geoffrey Smith, Clay Jones and Fred Downham, and comparing horticultural notes with Angela Rippon. At 7.35, Selena Scott and Jeff Banks present the final of the clothes show model competition, together with the wedding video of the Bride of the Year. Jamie's 10% of viewing oil is fought over in the courtroom in Dallas at 8, and at 8.50, Anne Robinson comments on more of your points of view. After the 9 o'clock news, QED teaches you how to solve your own problems by using the Alpha Plan. Sports Night, Part 1, at 10, includes highlights of one of the night's top soccer matches, as well as a report from the French Alps on the World Speed Skiing Championships. Owen Arwell Hughes examines the Sanctus in music from the masses at 10.45, and after the Gospel according to St. Luke, the second part of Sports Night at 11.35 has semi-final highlights of the amateur boxing in Preston. Now, a look at the weather. Well, the night will be fairly mild, but damp and misty in many places. Tomorrow, much of the country will start grey and misty, with rain or drizzle in places. But brighter weather, with some sunshine, will spread to much of Scotland and Northern Ireland during the day, and it will also brighten up in central and eastern areas of England. It will be fairly warm in the brighter parts of England, with temperatures as high as 17 degrees Celsius, 63 degrees Fahrenheit, but it will remain quite misty. If, at the forthcoming election, you think you won't be able to vote in person because you may be working away from home, on holiday, or if you're ill or disabled, you may be entitled to vote by post or by proxy. So ask your electoral registration officer, the town hall will give you the address, for a form of application now. Do not wait, or you may be too late. Don't lose your vote. That was a public information film. Now, a last look at the clock. It's one and a quarter minutes to midnight as we close down for the night. Sir Roy Strong is continuing his week standing in for Brian Matthew on Radio 2 for Round Midnight, which has another hour yet to go. But now, on behalf of all of us here on BBC One, this is Peter Bolgar wishing you a very good night.